<laughs> well, you forgot. Oh, the desk. What the fuck was that? <laughs> My drink! I had a swig of water. Oh. Um. Okay. Like that, but loud. Yeah, it's just had a it's just weird <laughs> noise. Like, boing! <laughs> it's like, it's like um, that sound effect someone would use, like, you have like Ant Man that's just gone down to size. <laughs> it's on the edge of a cliff and it looks like there's a massive waterfall and he falls off and he's like, no, and he just hits the water really hard. <laughs> and he hears a little thing. Yeah, it's like a re really, really distant. They start off big and go. <laughs> yeah. Like a nit committing suicide. <laughs> in the bath. A nit committing suicide in the bath. Nah. Or it's like, honey, I should try the kids, but one of the kids just can't take it anymore. Oh. They're giving up. Oh, do you think we could do effects like that? No. No. That's a lot of um, green screen and. Yeah. Maybe. But. We need a green screen. It's not just a green screen, it's they. They must they had a lot of I'd love some kind of episode with like giant stuff. What do you what would you call like it? Like a proper one. Like Planet of the Giants. Like done they had good. a proper prop studio where they made shit loads of stuff, the set was No, they for Honey built. I Shrunk the Kids, they literally built Physical. Physical what's the word? Like Let's it, get physical. In, no, physical. In, in filmmaking practical. They used practical effects in Honey I Shrunk the Kids and made literal giant props. Yeah. We haven't got that budget. No. We might be able to get away with shrinking us by computer effects at a very limit. Yeah, just have us walk along the green Actually, screen. the episode or the story after this one we're doing is Planet of the Giants. Ah, maybe they can which, give us some ideas. Which is a 60s version of yeah, that. So let's see what they do. In order for us to be giants, all we have to do is just film somewhere really small, go to like Legoland. Well, I think Planet have of the... For, I haven't seen Planet of the Giants yet. And we'll get to that next you time. You have not seen it? No. That's... It's... Yeah, we'll get. That's the next story we're doing after this one, basically. Okay. But I do know that it's more the TARDIS crew are small, and they're on a planet of the giants. Or are they just normal size and just Bigfoot everywhere? Or yeah, maybe maybe they're normal size and the giant the planet. Well, is maybe the giants are normal the... size, but they enter through a shrinking <laughs> ring. We'll find out next time in season two, episode one. However, today <laughs> we have season one, episode whatever the fuck it is, but. 359. It is the final one of this season. Ooh. However, back He's in... He's got a cool hat. The Reign of Terror. Oh, that doesn't sound very nice. That sounds rather... I'm not going to read the blurb, terror, actually. Is it? Because I don't want to give away anything for us. Uh -huh. But I haven't seen this one either. Oh. So, fresh for both of us. Back to back. It's the final of the series, but... Back in the 60s, they didn't really have the concept of a season final. Oh, so, so it's going to be a bit shit ending. I, no, I, th yeah, ending. I think it's just going to be the same as a normal episode. Right. But with whatever plot I won't put too I mean, much hype on it. I'm going to guess, it. don't put hype on it because it's a series final. Just think it's just, just think the last it one. It's not special. As a Doctor Who episode, but it's the last one of this season. Yeah, okay. But I think it's a historical, judging by the okay. picture of the packet. Okay, I'll cry that. Something to do with a guillotine. Oh, God. Doctor in very posh, sort of, is that French? Madoa! Is that Madoa. a French uniform? I don't know. It's red, white and blue on his sash thing. So maybe we're in France. Most likely the guillotine was a French invention. invention. But they used it, they do use it in other... They do use it in other, um... Other, um... There goes the speaker. I just noticed part of my desk's really wobbly. It's fine. Pull that speaker back up. Technical issues. Okay, now we can come back. 
A little bit longer than it, but yeah, I have a wobbly bit of the desk, basically. And wibbly, 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 wobbly. everything over. Why Not can't everything. I talk? Wibbly, wibbly, wobbly, 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 the tongue is really independent of the mouth. Da -da 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 -da. You're tongue-tied. <laughs> Baby got me tongue-tied. Let's go. With episode one. I don't need to press the buttons. You my mind transfers. Yeah, your, mu your, mu your mind's more powerful than a Sonic. Mm. Land. A land of fear. Yeah, it could be really dark and have like a mechanism on someone's throat that he pushes its Sonic screwdriver and, and it chops explodes it. or yeah. something, yeah. It's no good at opening locks. <laughs> no! It's like the disc neck things from Wild Wild West. Yeah, yeah. And now we have to run. No sound effects for the TARDIS? They, they run out of budget. <laughs> Maybe they didn't have the sound effects. Is the sound on? The speaker? Yeah. Oh. I've only just noticed. The background's just paint. That's not actual roundels on the wall. <laughs> After all these years, I only just know. Uh, maybe it's an another budget cut. <laughs> Come on, BBC, I can't fucking do this all night. I know it's hard to say goodbye, but one day you'll understand why we had to. The grandfather can bring you back any time now. <laughs> it's taken us eight, nine episodes to fucking get back now, girl. Don't, don't big me up. And then think... when you're in the neighbourhood, you know, it's time to go home. Yeah. <laughs> How nice. <laughs> Piss off, then. Are you so certain you know where we are? Certain? Of course I'm certain. If you doubt me... It... Doctor, not being funny, but are you... Past record? <laughs> you don't have a record at the moment. We've made it to Earth no times. Minor fault. On one occasion, perhaps twice. But nothing I couldn't control. I know that. Of course you're in control. You're always in control. Tell me what he wants to hear. Go on. Very simple. Quite simple. Exactly. Quite simple. And they're both just <laughs> kissing his ass right now. You may not find There's a chance that we won't meet again. Don't you think it would be better if we parted under more friendly circumstances? Say, over a drink? Yes. <laughs> yes, well, perhaps, yes, yes, yes. Maybe, maybe, maybe. <laughs> Need a bit of whiskey in me to... Fly home. You have me out drink, sir. You have me out drink. It's very warm, isn't it? It must be summertime. Mm -hmm. Take off your clothes. Well, it's just warm. Take off your clothes. <laughs> They're barely wearing any clothes. Exactly. Ian, you're hurting him. No, I'm not. Ian, what have I told you about kidnapping children? Yes, he's going to believe you. Yes. Of us? What of something else? Come along, answer my questions, boy. Please, I've done nothing. We're not going to hurt you. No, of course we're not. Not yet. <laughs> That's what we want to know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They're not going to hurt you, son. I, on the other hand, will slap you from here to Where kingdom. Where is this? Uh, okay, I was thought I thought so. Yeah, Don't come near me. <laughs> oh, what hell? We lost him. Crafty little bastard. Yeah. I don't know why he was so afraid. Um, <laughs> the doctor was practically gonna. <laughs> and Ian pretty much manhandled the boy. <laughs> oh, for God's sake, Charlie, I said <laughs> smooth. Fluent with the frickin' rig. Smooth! <laughs> Not my fault, Matt! They left the wire in the way! The wire's always fucking there, it's the 60s! Health and risk assessment? No, we don't have that. <laughs> Possible? You know, I think we ought to get back to the ship while we still can. Nonsense! Your idea to Ian, is that a sense of smugness? I can't <laughs> detect. What feels good? The what? arrogance on Ian's face. Like, <laughs> We're not here. Kind of. We're like ten meters behind you, bitch. We're fine. Mm -hmm. 
they're just having, they're just having a little bit of a lover's moment. Think about it. <laughs> well, the doctor went off on the same. It's not that those guys are not a good off. thing. Oh, okay. Here they are. Having a little bit of a family, family time. Really? You can't wait for that? One second of an alley. Okay. You could have held on the alley a little bit longer, maybe, there. Yeah, that was right. Like... Is he now? <laughs> How's he gonna do that? <laughs> I mean, this show, this show is... Where they're going anyway. Yeah. Because he shot more of the barn. Too dark to see anything, Doctor. Oh, for God's sake, God... Who the fuck... Who's a cameraman? <laughs> Someone who got fired after this, probably. <laughs> This. What do you think a candlestick like that's doing in a place like this? I don't know. I do like the uh, the black glare the lights giving out though. Yeah, that's just that's just the camera. I know, but I just like that effect. It's very it's very old fashioned and creepy. Mm. Very like every candle has a darkness horror movie. Ooh. Hey, look at all these maps. There's a whole bunch of daggers down here. Documents. They're just raiding to someone else's property. <laughs> Literally. They, they think they're in an RPG, it's fine. You just go into houses, open things, read documents. Dust? dust? Anybody? No? <laughs> dust? Dust! Anybody? No? A little bit of dust. It's got our lines on it. <laughs> we, we we don't have to remember as much. I'm trying to see. Oh it. shit! They killed me off. <laughs> I didn't read this part. Let's go and find him. Don't move. Oh. Why? Did you fire? Yeah, you burn them with you it. Say burn please. down the house. Yeah, no. You did say please. Oh, I said thank you. Okay, he's the fair but good leader. He's gonna try to overthrow him. Ah, uh, okay. Or oh, he's just gonna be the whiny one that ends up getting killed. <laughs> Stop it! For the moment he's safe, it was in your power to see that he came to no harm. But your answer proves that you do not speak truthfully. There is something you are concealing. It doesn't concern you. Bitch, you fucked up, Barbara. They found us. But they'll take us to Paris to the guillotine. We'll play our cards like God that it happened. We must know why we have the chance. Yeah, he is going to be the little, little whiny bitch, isn't he? He's going to run out in a minute and just get himself killed or something. He's going to portray, uh, betray them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's a long time since I had a Rylus to myself. <laughs> Your eyes open. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> Wait, who the f who's the crazy one? <laughs> Don't judge a book by a cover just because he's missing an eye doesn't mean he's crazy. He just likes to kill people. Seems the soldiers followed him. He knew you were taking this The soldiers that can't see through plain glass, apparently. Oh shit, we forgot about him, and we knocked him out and then just sort of left him there. Yeah. I was right. I think. Maybe. Well, yeah, he's out in front of them. Does he betray them or does he. I wish to join you. We're like having bets over which ones he's. What's he gonna do? <laughs> Oh, <laughs> that's easy. Oh, that was quick. Well, everyone's dead. Well, but apart from our guys, but. Doctor. 
<laughs> yeah, they just left him knocked out on the floor. Is that is, is that all right, calm down, Susan. I smell OAP, but I can't quite see anyone, so it's fine. Did anyone just hear that from upstairs? No? Okay, let's go outside. Why should we do what Madame Guillotine can do so much better? <laughs> let's take them to Paris to the guillotine! Uh-oh. <laughs> I'm not sure. I think I prefer the gun shot. What, gun over? Guillotine, yeah. Guillotine. I mean, guillotine, yeah, quicker, faster death. I think, yeah. But I think I maybe... You have a chance of getting away if it's a bullet. Ah. Uh, but, if it's a whole fucking firing squad like that. Well, are you seen stormtroopers? <laughs> And they're not proper soldiers. Yeah, but still, enough bullets fired in one direction will eventually hit their target. Actually, are they proper soldiers or not? No. no. The, one of the guys, they, well, maybe some of them are, but mm. the dude who got shot first said you, they, you may put them in uniforms, but they're uh, still peasants. Yeah. Okay. And the doctor's waking up like, oh, it's getting a bit hot in here. It's... Who left the fucking heating on? Oh. Wait, heating. This is not possible with heating. <laughs> oh, yeah. What year is this set? I know they mentioned it, I forgot. They did mention it. French Revolution. When the fuck was the French Revolution? Uh... It's one of those times. It is. Because that's funny. No, that's a model. Oh, I know that was a model. I just expect one of my little model trains to go doot doot. <laughs> oh, I love model shots, I can't help it. Ah, the boy remembered the doctor was in there, maybe. Why would the boy save him? Mm. Because he's a good citizen. Is he though? No. <laughs> He's taking a sweet ass time. I just want the doctor to suffer. Yeah. It's that, I'll save him, but it's I want that, him to suffer. It's that meme of the house burning in the background with the little girl looking evilly at the camera. They didn't, they didn't want to buy my cookies. Yeah. Just, uh... We're going to get a cliffhanger. Oh, uh, we are, aren't we? I think we might. Yeah, they're, they're dragging this... Oh, oh, they're doing a pan, they're doing a pan. Next time. To be continued. Next, Next episode. episode. Guest of Ma guests of Madame Guillotine. Ha ha ha! Madame Guillotine is here to cut your hair off. Boo, boo, boo. Ooh, I like how they've kept the fire going. Hmm. No, you just forgot to turn it off. <laughs> oh, I want to see who the freaking cameraman was. Oh, did we uh, miss it yet, or? Uh, where are we go? Story editor, designer. designer. Come on, come on. Safety producer. Producer. Did we have cameraman at all? I don't think we did. Yeah, good. I wasn't, I wasn't paying attention for the first couple of credits. That's episode, yeah, yada yeah, yeah. Madame Guillotin. The guest song. Why is it when you put on a French accent, you we tend to get a bit more snobbish? Oh, I don't know. Oh, I don't know. French stereotypes of the British. <laughs> I don't think it showed them. No. That's it. Who's the shit camera operator? <laughs> he was so bad, he didn't like, get We're not even credit. putting you in the credits, yeah. man. That's just, 
That's just appalling, even by you're, our standards. You're not worth the credit. I mean, yeah, you oh. may have not dropped the camera, but you might as well have. I mean, we <laughs> know you were there. Twice we st I noticed that he messed up. Yeah. But no, I can... No I can for me. Oh, okay. I can, I can let that pass, though. I can, just because... I don't know. It's, it's little things that make it up, and they didn't have the... I, I kind of... At the beginning, did they? But thinking back, you, you, oh look, thinking back, I must don't have the freights off. I don't think we've had it at all yet with the first I doctor. I swear we have. So maybe it hasn't even been invented yet. Because I th I remember making a comment. I think it was on the keys of Marinus where they landed on a beach, and I was like, oh, we didn't have the. <laughs> I gotta, I, gotta, I gotta find this out. I swear it's been played before. But the only way we're gonna know is by Google. Just go Google like first use of TARDIS warp, whatever the. In the comics they pronounce it warp. Uh, warp. Or TARDIS sound effect. Two hours later. When did you. Uh, Oh, when? Well, we're not having any luck with that. Are you really that? We can find out in between. Right, yeah, you can always cut this out. It's, yeah, no, I will I'll cut out us looking at that. You, you, have oh, a, have, really bucket. have a look in between. Because we'll, we just got to give our quick outro. I quite enjoyed that, to be honest. We've had better, but it wasn't bad. No, it wasn't bad. I'm thinking of story, remember? I know, but... Stop focusing on the cameraman. He was a knobhead. No, Ignore it's, him. it's not just a cameraman. <laughs> it's the whole of it together is... What, like the editing and stuff? Yeah, it's like they were... Tr they were trying too much all at once. They were, they were sort of... And they had a cut when it did not need to be a cut. You, d you don't cut oh, on when nothing's adding, happening. Yeah. Well, moments after that, the doctor said, oh, and it's deserted. Mm. So I, I think the cut might have been there to it just show that it was deserted. They could have, they had it too quick, I think. Yeah. They could have cut, held it, or rather than just what looked like a picture of an alley being spliced in between them talking, mm. it's have it pan across the alley as the doctor says, hmm, this place is deserted. I am quite surprised that the um, two Frenchmen were killed quite early on. That was out of nowhere. I thought they were going to end up being like the side characters of the yeah, story. Like prisoners, but no, they're just yeah. dead. Okay, cool. Well, okay. Whitaker. David Whitaker was the story editor. Any relation? We must kill this David before he re reproduces. Yes, they're back in time. It's but probably... it's only got one T, hasn't it? Yeah, it, I don't think it's a relation. <laughs> David Whitaker, use this condom! No, like... <sighs> I went to see Justin Bieber's parents last week. Come on, it's your turn. It's not, it's not, it's not... Jodie, I've got the problem with. It's Chibnall. Yeah. I have to see what she's like without Chibnall to know whether she's good or not. But isn't it the... Who actually brings the character of the Doctor to the table? It's got to Depends be the actor. how it's written as well, mind. Normally they let the, the actor fill in their own version of the Doctor and maybe but direct the thing, it to the do the little But the thing we've tweets. been waiting for is the darkness of the Doctor, which she hasn't really shown. Like, the anger. Yeah, she showed glimpse. But she seems to be quite just sort of barely holding her shit together. Times, yeah. So we maybe need more moments where she can actually show the darkness. They just haven't been written. Yeah. Anyway, let's not worry about that. We've got a year with that. Well, about half a year now. Well, I don't know because we don't know what month next year it'll be out. So we've probably got about a year until the next series. Hopefully in that year they can do something good. I haven't got the highest of hopes, but next time, something about Madame Guillotine. The guests of Madame Guillotine. The guests of Madame Guillotine. I'm going to stop that now.
It's hurting other throat. A little bit. 